can't be sobbing in the pool. Breast kind of looks similar to the. We are headed to dinner when I'm feeling stuff like this, but. Hey y'all and welcome to my channel. I'm Lisa Michelle and I am back with another video. As you guys can tell by that title, your girl got some stuff going on this week, y'all. You know, it's the middle of the week, but it's still going to be considered like a weekly vlog or whatnot because I am doing stuff this week, even though it's later in the week. Y'all get it? Get it. So today is Wednesday. It is August 21st, and we're getting ready to take my baby to her four-month appointment. Y'all cannot believe, like, she's four months. Like, where have time gone? Y'all was packing up her newborn clothes that she have never wore, her diapers and everything because I'm getting ready to give it to my cousin, which she's having her baby in January. So I'm like, you know what, girl, come get this stuff. So I was packing up all her newborn stuff and I was starting to get teary eyed and I'd be like, oh my gosh, she would never be this small again. Like in a couple of years, she's going to be cussing me out because I won't let her spend the night over somebody else's houses because I'm not going to play that. Like, period, point blank. Too much going on. So, we're going to her former's appointment. I already packed her baby bag. I already got her dress, myself dressed because we kind of running behind on time when it came down to being on time. Like, we don't be on time, but we kind of late for the check-in time, if that makes sense. So, I made sure I packed her some Tylenol this time because last time at her two-month appointment, Y'all, she boo hoo freaking cry like really, really bad. So, you know what? If I go ahead and bring the Tylenol this time, literally right after she get them shots, I go ahead and give her the medicine, and then I could turn around and give her her bottle. So, you know, she kind of be distracted from the pain or whatnot. So, I hope everything goes good at this appointment. I can't wait to see how much she weighs. I'm really excited to know about that because she is big and she is very heavy. Then I'm also going to run to Target to see if I can find some um, stuff to wear to this all brown dinner party I got coming up. Now, I do have something brown in my closet, but I wore that when I was pregnant, like, last year, September. And I'm not trying to wear that again. I'm trying to, you know, get something new, y'all, because I am 5'1". And fashion over dresses just be a tad bit too long for me, and I just, I can't do it. Then I'm also going to be doing some random stuff throughout this week, too, as well. And I'm like, you know what, let me pick up the camera and vlog this because... I've been on the road, y'all. I dropped two vlogs back to back and a story time. And now here it is, my third vlog within the month of August. So August is like content month. I'm trying to just get back to picking up the camera and doing stuff. They be like, oh, everything is content. But sometimes some stuff really don't be content. Because I be like, okay, I'm going to vlog this or I'm going to record this. And I be like, you know what, never mind. I'm not even going to do it. But I'm just trying to get back into the groove of vlogging. So we is back. But let's go ahead and jump to this video because we don't got much time. So let's head to her doctor's appointment. So we is at her doctor's appointment. We just checked in. So now we is waiting to be called to the back. She is getting her four month shots today. But I'm so glad my mama came to this appointment because when she had to get her two month shots, I was by myself. I was nervous. Yeah. Look at her. What about it? Uh, you can't be sobbing in the pool. Oh, look at them thighs. Oh my god. You're right. You're right. Oh, my god. Oh, my god. Yes, ma'am. Oh, they just called us a bag. Yeah, so we in the room now. They just did her weight, her head, and see how long she is. Y'all, she is 20 pounds, 11 ounces, and freaking four months. Y'all, she is so chunky. Well, her head is just so little. So now we're waiting for her doctor to come in. I'm going to be asking her some questions that I have as far as with the probiotics, baby food, and with her drooling a lot because I'm not sure if she's getting ready to tease or whatnot. The nurse said they don't tease until six months. Now she thought my baby was six months. She's only four, that's how big she is. But 
we gonna go ahead we gonna see if she go ahead and say i could go ahead and do the oatmeal for her baby food then that'd be perfect because i've been giving her the cup baby food the apple cinnamon oatmeal cereal so yeah we're gonna see and we gotta say we're gonna say Yeah, y'all, and then after everything is talked about and checked up and things like that, we're going to go ahead and get her shots right after. That's going to be the last thing to do. But thank God, when it comes down to her shots, I got her Tylenol. So now that I know her weight, I'll be able to know how much Tylenol I can give her. As soon as we leave out of our doctor's appointment, I'm going to go ahead and give her the Tylenol. Because I know that she's going to be really sleepy. She's going to be drowsy. She's not going to be her best self after she gets these shots. Because that's how she was at her two-month appointment. So, Mama is very prepared this time around. Right, book. So, we talked to the doctor. The doctor ended up leaving out the room. So, what I'm getting ready to do is I'm going to make her bottle. And I'm also going to get her Tylenol already. So, since she weighs 20 pounds. She can now get 3.75 ml of Tylenol. So I'm gonna go ahead and prep that for her so she can get it literally right after she get her shot. And I'm also make her a bottle so she can have it to drink down after she get her shots. I can't go prepared, y'all. I was not going in at all. This is the milk that she gets, which is the pink can at three Walmarts. They all is completely gone. So yeah, we gotta make it do what it did. But she is drinking eight ounces, y'all. Eight ounces. So y'all, we had left her doctor's appointment. She did amazing. She barely cried when she got her shots. I did not record it because I was kind of on edge. I was like, oh my God, my baby, and I'm about to get teary eyed. So we was at Target because I'm trying to find this brown dress that I've been seeing going around on TikTok. And I was gonna go to Walmart to get her baby food, but since I'm already at Target, I feel like I could go ahead and just get it from Target instead of going to Walmart. So the dress that I've been seeing is silky and it got like a black piece right here. And I cannot find it. Okay. Let me see. Oh, see, they got silky, but it's green. Oh, it's green. Okay, y'all, so we got her shot. I'm going to go ahead and get her shot. So, the dress kind of looks similar to this, but it is brown, and this is not it. This is a large. This color is actually cute, too, y'all, but I'm not sure. So let's see what else they got. Let's see. Y'all, my baby is in a car sleeping. <laughs> She's so okay. tight after right. her shots. Let me. Oh, it had no um, blood squirted out? Yeah. Um, it must have wiped my shirt, so I don't worry about that. Oh. Look at what the stain is on my shirt. Uh, girl, we was gonna have to report them. You gonna have to report them? Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna find it. So, I'll probably have to end up just getting something of fashion over. Yeah, yeah, it's a little like fashion over it is. 
because Shin is gonna take too long to get here and I don't have time for that. So yeah, we're just gonna do Fashion Nova and just call it a day. And then if anything, I could just roll it up so it could actually fit me, but yeah. We came to Target, we don't see it. My mom will see it, so we can just go get the baby food since we here. Y'all, we is down the baby aisle right now, and I am trying to figure out if I should get her the butternut squash because sweet potatoes is okay, but she not really be feeling it. So these is the ones that they got right here. So this one say butternut squash. So I'm gonna get one of the butternut squash. I'm gonna get sweet potato. And what, sweet potato corn? I think sweet potato corn would be good. Uh, I'm not sure. Okay, that's carrot sweet potato peas. And this one is that. Um, and then they got down here apple blueberry. This is her favorite right here. But no oatmeal cereal because it got stuff in there. So I'm going to do both of these and then just see how she likes it. Hopefully she do. But what about sweet potato corn? No, don't get Just get her what she said. Plain. Okay, so... Mm -hmm. Y'all, we is back home from the doctor office in Target. And y'all, she is taking her nap right now. She's going to be asleep for a minute, y'all, because that Tylenol is still in her system. I gave her a warm bath to help with the pain with the shots where they stuck her at. And then I end up giving her some milk. So she's going to be knocked out for a little bit. But while she's knocked out, I'm going to go ahead and get some stuff done around the house and figure out what I'm going to eat. Y'all, I am so tired. I want to lay down right now, but I know if I was to lay down and get comfortable and she wake up, I'm not going to be able to do anything that I wanted to do. So I'm like, let me go ahead and do that now. But I wanted to show you guys what I got from Target that was off of camera. I didn't find nothing for myself, but I did find something for her. So I end up getting this dress because we is going to a all brown dinner party. So this is what the dress looks like. It is super cute. It is a 12 months. Y'all, she is a big baby, so I have to go up on her size. And then it also came with these pants, which is super duper cute. And y'all, it comes with the little hat. Like, oh my god. This is so cute. And the hat clips on right here. It just screams like fall for summer with the hat. So I cannot wait for her to wear this. I wash everything I buy. I just bought her a mini skirt from Walmart here the other day. And it was so so freaking cute my like, girl yes and then i end up grabbing these two essence lip gloss so i got one in clear and then i got the other one like in this pink tint i have tried the nyx lip oil um it don't last long i'm so mad that y'all overhyped it but i love the cover girl yummy lip gloss that lip gloss is my life baby i love it so i'm most definitely be trying these two because this one say extreme shine and then the other one that was like this it was also pink and it had glitter 
I'm not really a glitter lip type of person, but that one was the lip plumper. I should have got that one as well, but I'm going to just see how I like these two, and then I will go back and get more if I like them. I went to Walmart. I could not find them, so I was glad that I found these at Target. And, yeah, that's pretty much everything I got from Target. I did not find something myself. So, 9 out of 10, I'm going to probably just end up going off a of Fashion Nova. Even though I don't want to. Or maybe this week I'll probably go inside like a store and see if I can find something. Hopefully I can. But yeah y'all. So that's it for Wednesday. Let me go ahead and get the stuff done out the way so I can lay down and chill. Because baby mama's is tired. So it is a couple of days later. And we are headed to dinner. When I'm talking about we, me and my baby. She is back there y'all. She is sleeping in her car seat but yeah we was on our way to dinner y'all i was going to talk to y'all while i was getting ready to go out but i was kind of pressed for time because i took a nap and i woke up like at 5 30 and my mission was to leave the house at 6 so thank god i started packing her baby bag packing up our clothes and everything around like 2 this afternoon because when you got a baby you got to get ready ahead of time because imagine if i didn't have nothing already packed we would have still been at home. So, um, I ended up waking up a little bit late. Well, 5.30. But, you know, still a little bit late because it starts at 8. And I'm a whole hour away. So, I had to at least leave at 6. No later than 6.30 to be on time. So, we are 37 minutes away. By the time I get there, it will be 7.28. So, that's perfect timing. Could that give me a chance to go ahead park put on my heels and things like that we're going to this restaurant called capital grill i personally have never been but it's my friend's favorite restaurant and it's like we're here to celebrate your birthday so girl we're gonna go ahead and make it do what it do but y'all i just cannot wait to taste these lamb chops she said they are the best lamb chops y'all the best lamb chops that i personally have had was at my old job that's to work at which is U bar if y'all ever visit Atlanta or if y'all live in Atlanta, y'all know about U-Bar. U-Bar has some good ass food. So, I don't know. I'm going to see. I'm going to see because everybody lamb don't be lambing. Okay. But my outfit is so cute. Y'all don't mind the mommy good. And y'all, you cannot wear like any sandals or anything like that. It's one of them restaurants that have like rules. So, I'm kind of nervous about this little piece right here. I'm going to just have my baby blanket like covering this little section because i don't want to get turned around i drove too far so yeah we're heading there now i just want to go ahead and just give y'all a little update but yeah i'm super excited i love birthday dinners especially when they have lamb on the menu for my sister's birthday i only had calamari because they didn't really have nothing else that i like but since they got lamb i'm like Ugh. I'm super excited. So I'm about to go ahead and listen to some music and then I will see y'all when we make it there. We is at dinner. We made it to have a grill. And it is so nice in here, y'all. It is pretty perfect in here. I love the setting. Y'all, this is all the people for dinner. <laughs> Y'all, this is the menu right here. And it's the Capital Grill. It's blurry. I don't even know why. But I end up getting the double cut lamb rib chops and I got four. So... Yeah, y'all, we gonna be trying this food. This is my first time eating here. So my friend said it was good. So we gonna go ahead and we gonna go with that. Y'all, my baby is over here. <laughs> so my food came. This is what the lamb chops look like. And I got a side of mashed potatoes. Well, we all pretty much got the same thing. Thank you. Time to look for everyone. Everyone's happy at the moment? Yes. 
Yeah, I did. I did. Oh. What are they talking about? Yeah. Right. Right? What are the lamb chops talking about? Nobody got triple fries? I thought you I had triple fries. fries. But this is, I don't eat lamb chops. Oh, right. Well, fries, I need, though. You can try some sauce on it. Oh, that's the hot sauce? Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Birthday girl with the birthday pig. One of Miami better. One of Miami better. One of Miami is better. Oh, it's way better. That's why I got the ring. Quite Are you sharing me? I told her that the first time. I told her that the first time. after my friend's surprise birthday dinner and i just want to say y'all this whole entire weekly vlog went accordingly like everything went as planned from my baby getting her shots to us going out to every single event because sometimes stuff do be happening to where you cannot make or attend a, an event but i still end up making and attending an event like yeah i'm just so happy about that because july i was supposed to do so much stuff and i end up not doing it but august was like my bounce back month for real and september is going to be even more better so i just wanted to go ahead and just let you guys know how things had them went i just thank god for that because baby whoo because imagine if i did not go i would not have no content for y'all but i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog if you guys are new to my channel make sure y'all go ahead and hit that subscribe button because your girl is back with the vlogs and the story times because september is my month period and i will see you guys in the next video Bye, y'all.